Hello everyone, Brianna here from So Cute and Quirky with another tip and talk about another foot. So today I'm going to talk about a patchwork foot and particularly also can be a quarter inch foot. It's used for patchwork particularly when we are piecing and for this, this foot from Bernina, the 37D foot which I have or a 37 foot or a 57 foot and a, and a 97 foot all are will give you a quarter inch seam allowance. These feet are really great. The one I have is the 37D and they have notches on them. So they can allow you to get super precise, which we want to because we want our quilts, we want our bags, we want our home decor items all to come out fun, pretty and great as gifts and accurate. If they're not accurate, then we're gonna have a problem when we put it together later. So to be accurate, we can use a foot that will give us that perfect quarter inch seam allowance. And this is the foot here. So look at this foot here. This foot, the 37D is the one I have and there's also 37. It has notches and those notches in the center is where the needle would come down. Uh, in between the foot, then we have one behind it, quarter inch behind and a quarter inch in front of it as well. And also along the edge, when we put our fabric down and line it up, it'll be a quarter inch from the needle center. Isn't that awesome? We don't have to really think about it. So it works for us and we get that quarter inch seam allowance and we will sew and we'll have great seams, put it together a project and not give us problems later on. And also in the front, we will see here when the needle goes down in the center, we will get that quarter inch seam allowance. So you can see the notch from the front too. You can see it right where the needle is at and also here. So follow along with me and let's see what this foot can do. All right, let's get ready to sew. So we will align our fabric along the edge of our foot. We have our foot on and ready to get sewing. We will put our foot down in the down position and our needle in the down position. And we will make sure that it's along the edge here. As we run along the edge, we will get that perfect quarter inch seam allowance. I'm going to also use the front notch so that I can stop a quarter inch in from the edge of the fabric here is what I will do too. And talking about these feet, the 37 using the edge gives us a quarter inch, but if you use the 57 foot, the 57 has a seam guide on the foot itself. And if you use the 97 foot, it has a seam guide that you can attach on the edge on your machine and along the edge of the foot there to also get your quarter inch. So you can use all of these feet to get that. So let's go ahead and sew a little bit here. And again, I'm going to stop. And just to remind you, I'm gonna stop. See this notch here? As I continue to sew, I am going to use that to help guide me to stop at a quarter inch here. So that also is a really great way to use this machine, which is fantastic. So I'm stopping right there. I'm gonna back up just a little bit and now I'm going to cut my threads and I now have my quarter inch and I stopped a quarter inch from the edge too. Isn't that cool? I love that. So we don't have to think about it and we can use this to have perfect quarter inch seam allowances and then our quilt will go together great or our bag or our projects. So thanks for watching. Have a good day and bye.